Fantasy friends, welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is KJ Ricardo, and today's video is a look at the references from the Lucy Desi Comedy Hour special, Lucy Goes to Mexico. This is a hilarious episode. It's really fun to watch, and there are quite a few references from this episode. They would have made perfect sense back in the 1950s for those viewers but not so much today in 2020. Some viewers might not know what these references are all about. And so I put together a compilation of these references. I explained them. And so that the next time you watch this episode, you'll know exactly what the characters are talking about. So sit back and enjoy. Our story tonight begins at the Hotel Del Coronado near San Diego, California. You see, Ricky Ricardo's band is doing a special USO show there for the Navy. And with him is that great entertainer, Maurice Chevalier. When are you... You can play as sure as you live. Something gotta give, something gotta give, something gotta give. I could be in the show. I could do a duet with Mr. Chevalier. Think of it. Two Maurice Chevaliers. Every little breeze seems to whisper the wheeze. Birds in the trees seem to twitter the wheeze. Sorry, I can't let you back in the United States until you prove it. But I was in the army. Which army? <laughs> the American army! I got a good kind of medal! <laughs> Who have you got in your trunk, Bridget Bardo? <laughs> we should be so lucky. Yankee Doodle Dandy. And that's it. That's all I have for you. I hope you enjoyed watching this video and just learning a little bit more about these references. They're very 
relevant to the 1950s. They have aged quite a bit. Some of these references might not make that much sense anymore in 2020, but that's why I like to make these videos to educate viewers about these references. So the next time that you watch this episode or any episode of I Love Lucy, you know what they're talking about. You understand these cultural pop culture references. So I hope that you enjoyed this video. Let me know what you enjoyed best or what you learned and I would be happy to read that. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys next time with another video. And remember to always laugh often.